Well, the cold is going from relentless to ridiculous across the northern and central U.S. over the next few days. We've got actually two shots of Arctic air coming our way. Let's go to the maps and show you what we're talking about. Starting with the first plunge of cold air, the low temperatures you're looking at here Thursday morning, 20 below zero in Fargo. Lots of sub-zero cold from North Dakota across Minnesota into Wisconsin and Michigan, and even as far south as Chicago on Friday morning. Now, Saturday morning, we get a bit of a reprieve from the southern Great Lakes to the Ohio Valley, but you start to see those colder colors showing up in the uh, upper Midwest. We'll get to that second shot of Arctic air in just a moment. We do want to touch on the Northeast because it's cold there, too below freezing everywhere Thursday morning and in some cases flirting with zero. Look at that four below zero in both Elmira and Buffalo Friday morning. And then Saturday morning we start to see the cold release its grip a little bit, but still well below freezing all across the northeast and mid-Atlantic on Saturday morning. Now, yes, there's a second plunge of Arctic air uh, heading southward. Look at these temperatures. You're seeing the temperatures in the black boxes and then those little uh, blue arrows showing you how far below normal. Look at that. 52 degrees below normal for high temperatures on Saturday. Yes, that was a high of 23 below zero on Saturday in Cutbank. That's a forecast. And the uh, temperatures uh, again, 40, 50, 55 degrees below normal again on Sunday across Montana and portions of the Northern Plains. Probably the uh, most frustrating place to be, Grand Forks, North Dakota. Over the next seven days, highs every single day in the single digits, either above or below zero. And look at those lows in the double digits below zero for six nights in a row. No reprieve in sight for the uh, Northern Plains. Unfortunately, we may be deep into March before we get a meaningful warming trend in the upper Midwest. I'm Nick Wilchin, The Weather Channel.